So I know my time is coming. I just gotta be patient. What's up, car crew, and welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Courtney Janine, and I'm back with another video. Today's video is going to be a let's talk new synthetic wig releases. Guero. I feel like we have so much to chat about and talk about, so I'm super excited. Before we get into today's video, if this is your first time seeing me here on the YT, hey girl, hey. My name is Courtney Janine. I do beauty, fashion, and lifestyle content. So definitely subscribe, join the Core Crew family down below, and let's get into today's video. All right, you guys. So I usually start with Outre, but today I want to just get Sensational out the way because they have two new units that I want to talk about. And you guys know that I have been really keeping an eye on Sensational recently just because they've been dropping like crazy. And this is no different. Like they just dropped two new wigs on their site and I'm just like so excited. I'm not gonna talk about any of the bundles or the ponytails today, but they are coming out with more of those. Let me know if you would like me to, but I feel like the wigs are the most important. So first up is a new bundle unit this is butter unit 21 so we're kind of going back in time because the latest unit like in terms of numbers the latest unit is 26 so they went back with 20 and now we're getting 21 21 looks extremely similar to 20 to me so the stock card I do like the color of course um, it's different but in terms of the style it's really giving butter 20 so I don't know what the difference is I was talking to one of my, my girls charisma's world you guys know I love charisma's world and we always be talking about the new wig so we think we're gonna get we be chatting it up and um she was saying that maybe it's different in terms of the texture so hoping that's the case because otherwise i just feel like it's super similar to what we've already seen with butter unit 20 maybe it's less tangly you guys know i gave y'all the real deal especially that one i was talking about how it was tangly so maybe this one would be a little bit different but yeah i think this is super pretty they describe it as a soft brushed loose curls and of course it has the hd lace and it comes in the balia colors and then next up we have a dashley unit i've never tried the dashley collection which is so crazy i feel like i i started wearing i've been wearing wigs since like 2014 2015 ish but when i started wearing wigs i just felt like synthetic wigs were super wiggy so I was doing human hair wigs, girl, and um, I just started wearing synthetic wigs probably like 2019, 2020. So I haven't tried all the collections. I haven't tried every single unit yet. And the Dashley collection is one of those collections that I have not tried. I believe it's similar to the Outre Lace Front collection, which is not my favorite anyway. So I feel like I probably won't like this collection. Um, but this is Dashley Lace Unit 23. Super similar. They're doing a lot of big, loose wand curls with layers sort of styles. And this one is no different. I think she's pretty. Like I mentioned before, I'm not the hugest fan of lace front units. I like to be able to pluck. I like to be able to just have a little bit more room in terms of like parting space. Yeah, I just like a lot of lace <laughs> um and with the lace front collection you probably don't have that much space to plug and do what you want so i probably will pass on this but i think she's super pretty and i like how it's similar to outre how where they come out with units that looks the similar but they're from different um collections and that's what i'm getting from like dashley unit 23 buddy unit 20 and buddy unit 21 they kind of look the same but they're different collections so everyone who has a specific like price point can get what they need get the look that they want for the price that they want you know all right next up we have outre and i'm super excited because they have a number of new sleek lay collections i'm a little bit jealous for the girls who love the sleek lay because for me personally i am a that's a hairline perfect hairline girl so i'm jealous that the sleek lay collection girls are getting all these different styles but i know my time is coming i don't know when outre i don't know when you're gonna come out with a couple new melted or perfect but i'm gonna be right here waiting okay period so i know my time is coming i just gotta be patient but we have a number of new um sleek leg collection units they dropped it on their youtube and on their site um a couple days ago and i was seeing y'all in the comments of their youtube so i love that y'all are going to their youtube and like scoping out the wigs too and a lot of people were super excited because sleek leg wigs have been very long and now we're getting like the mid-length units that we know i love i know y'all love more like everyday styles so let's go ahead and talk 
talk about them. First up, we have Analia. She's super pretty. She looks like Giovanna to me, just a little bit longer. She is a, oh, it doesn't say the style, but it's a super like wavy, yeah, wavy, 24 inches, layers. Super pretty. I like the color. It's frosted dark blonde. I feel like I've tried that before. Super pretty. I think this is pretty, but um, there are other styles that are coming out that are a little bit more like different. And for me, if I'm not trying a new color, I want a new style. You know, so I feel like a lot of these other styles are a little bit more new to the sleek life. So I probably will go for those. So let's just keep on going. We have Mariposa. This is a wavy style as well or a crimp wave. 22 inches synthetic, of course. It comes in colors like salted caramel, ginger copper. Two colors that I have not tried before. With these sort of crimps and waves I feel like crimps are a little bit the most difficult just because with crimp styles it's very important that the wig comes pre-plugged because once you start plucking where all the crimps and the waves are messed up so I'm gonna stay away from this one just because like I mentioned before there are other units that I feel like are a little bit more new more eye-catching and I'm excited to try them more than this style so let's go ahead and move right along you guys this is one that I'm super excited about this is called Shadora she's 14 inches wave she looks like a Nisha but in the sleep play part and you guys know let me give you a tea I do love Nisha I love Nisha because I love a good yak I love a good yak I love a good kinky and um, that's why I love Nisha but Nisha is a lace front unit so it's not enough room to plug it's not that much leeway this looks like a Nisha but in a sleek lay and I already really love how the sleek lay units come very flat and the parting space is a lot um, just looks a little bit more natural than the lace front unit just because you're paying for that quality lace so I'm super excited about this also love how it's a mid-length sort of style I think she looks super duper pretty I see colors like a ginger copper and Sunkiss brown two colors that I have never tried before it also comes in chocolate swirl golden honey blonde honey ginger black cherry honey brown sunkiss brown and ginger copper some colors that I've never tried before I definitely want to pick this up I'm super excited about um trying it so yes I will be reviewing this wig don't know when she's coming out I believe this month sometime and honestly once it goes on the YouTube and the site it usually goes up on the wig site pretty soon so i'm hoping that this is coming out sooner than later and then next we have aura oh gorgeous 14 it says wavy but it doesn't look wavy to me it looks like it has some layers in it and it's a kinky straight unit you guys this looks absolutely gorgeous it comes in chocolate swirl sandy blonde golden amber black cherry honey brown cinnamon spice and ginger copper gorgeous 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 this is like a perfect everyday unit and like i mentioned before i know you guys are looking for new styles i feel like this is such a new style for the sleek leg collection of course like i mentioned before styles are gonna get repetitive but sleek leg collection have been a lot of lengthier units so i'm glad that they are branching out to different um lengths and more mid-length um shorter units because that's perfect for the everyday okay and i'm super excited about um trying out this unit all right next we have um two new lace front units first up is erin she is a straight 24 inches a bit of layers i think this is such a classic style i am probably not going to review just because it's a little bit of a traditional style not super um new or exciting um but i think what is exciting is this new pika boo color okay it it comes in 35 slash Pika 27613, 430 slash Pika 3527. I will try to include a picture of the Peekaboo colors on here. I think that's the most exciting. But other than that, I feel like it's a super um, traditional style. So if you like that, then I definitely think that you could pick it up. But in terms of like it being a showstopper, I don't think so. Next up, we have another lace front. This is called Marbella. Super duper pretty. It kind of looks like the Sensational Water Wave 16 that I have in my possession but I still haven't reviewed it I'll review it sometime but I feel like this is so pretty I just you guys know how I feel about the lace front collection actually the last lace front I reviewed was what was the name of that unit I just reviewed it I don't know but it it looks good it looks good like 
I was super surprised. Um, so maybe it's like gotten better. I don't know. Probably won't review this. Like I mentioned, there are a lot of sleep aid units coming out. So I feel like I'm going to be more inclined to do that <laughs> than um, this. But super excited about all these new units. They're also coming out with a converted cap called Sweet Annie. It's a kinky straight long unit. Super pretty. You guys know I'm growing out my hair. But as soon as I grow out my hair, I have a ton of different converted caps that I want to try with some leave out because I feel like they are doing a great job of coming out with different curl textures something for us kinky girls and I feel like this is perfect and then lastly we have a new wig pop collection this is called Ruel um uh, you guys I am realizing that for me I really like bang units when I cut them I don't know like I recently bought um and I don't think I talked about Regina but Regina is a new wig pop collection unit as well maybe I'll throw in some clips if I didn't delete it I probably deleted it off my camera to, for space but anyways I tried to review Regina and I just don't really like the bangs even with Jasmia I wasn't a huge fan of them like the bangs on it it's weird because I do I, I'm all for convenience I would pay for convenience but it's like it's something about cutting the bangs yourself than just having it come with it I don't know the only bang wig that I feel like I really did like was my first wig Darlene Ruelle is cute I just don't like mixing like curls and bangs like I feel like it looks the best when it's just like all straight or if it's curly bangs it's with curly hair you know but yeah you guys that's it that wraps up today's let's talk new synthetic wig releases we had so much to chat about you guys let me know down in the comments which units you are picking up as a reminder I feel like the only I definitely want to review but a you butter lays 21 i think she's super pretty i don't want to compare her to butter 20 and then i also am very interested in the sleep lay units from Eltre. and um yay yeah, guys let me know which units you are going to be picking up down in the comments let me know your thoughts on my hair it is a part of my wigtober series so if this video is probably not out yet but it will be very soon and you'll be knowing which um wig and how i put this look together so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up thank you again so so much for liking commenting subscribing and joining and being a part of the corker family i love you guys so much and i'll see you all in my next one bye guys